So it seems to me EA have released some pretty decent content today. With team of the season coming to a close, FIFACoinZone.com are starting a brand new thing on their site where they're doing top series packs. Make sure you go check them out and use code HABER to get yourself 5% off. We've got the 84 plus tradable team of the week upgrade and the 81 plus untradable team of the week upgrade. The tradable 84 plus requires an 83 rated squad, whilst the untradable 81 plus requires only a 81 rated squad. So it's not too bad, actually. We've got 10 up here, but we're going to go open George's first and see if we can get anything good. Now, obviously, the 84 rated uh, tradable one guarantees you a walkout in every single one because every 84 rated plus team of the week is a walkout. So that's pretty dope. Uh, so let's go ahead and open up some and see if we can get ourselves some at decent. So we're going to open up George's packs now. He has a uh, premium loan player reward. No one cares about that. Um, so he's got all these 80, 81 pluses and then he's got a couple 84 pluses as well. I just want to gauge what these are like and see if they're decent. And we're starting off, unfortunately, with a non-walkout. Now, the good thing about this, obviously, all these players will be decent for ev uh, eventually to be decent for SBCs. We're going to start off with, I think that's Bamba from, from Cardiff. Yeah, we've got Bamba, first one. Not too bad. Decent Irish player. Please don't get baited by it. Just don't get baited by it. Just don't. Just don't. Please don't do it. <laughs> um, okay, so I want to see how many walkouts we're getting in the untradable ones here, if we get any at all. Uh, because I think I've got majority tradable ones on my account. I don't know if I should grind out some untradable ones as well. I think it's good value, though. Like I said, like they'll all be decent eventually for SBCs. Who's this? Is this... Um, Oh, okay. Danny Ings, not too bad. We'll take it. Any ones that are decent to link with, for example, Prem, uh, decent to link. Uh, like, for example, uh, Bamba as well. Any that are decent to link are always nice. Um, so that's pretty decent. We do have a walkout in an untradable one. What's it going to be? Go on, be somewhat big. I don't know who it's going to be, realistically. It's going to be a Spanish centre mid. I have no idea who this is going to be. Um, is it Pedro Leon? No, it's Juan, Juan Jordan, 84 rated. Uh, I mean, I think he's decent to link. Is he in the is he in the Liga or Liga 1, 2, 3? Okay, so he's in he's in the first Spanish league. That's not too bad. That's pretty decent to link still. Um, there's some high-rated players you can link him to there. Sadly, no walkout in the last untradable one, but of course, we have two guaranteed walkouts. Now, in terms of the informs, I don't know which version of, for example, Messi or, for example, Ronaldo it's going to be if you get a, a Messi or Ronaldo. Ooh, Rebic isn't bad. Um... I don't know which version it's going to be. I don't know if it's going to be their highest rated inform. I don't know whether it's going to be their lowest rated inform. I don't know. Like, literally don't have a clue uh, if it's going to be uh, any any specific version of them or it could be a random version of them. So, um, so we'll see. If we get a Portuguese or, or Argentinian flag, you know, it might be a bit exciting and then very disappointing. So, we'll have to see. We do have a walkout, though, in the first one. Obviously, it's going to be a walkout. It's going to be Argentinian. It's going to be Cam. I don't know who this is going to be. Okay. Well, we actually did get an Argentinian in our first one. It was kind of scary. We've got Gaetan. Pretty terrible, if you ask me. Uh, I don't know what the value of these informs are, but I don't think you're making profit on these unless you've done it with untradable players. Um, what's he going for? Yeah, he's already dropped to about 20-ish K. He's probably dropped to like 15K, to be honest. Yeah, he's, he's very, very cheap, which isn't a bad thing. It makes a lot of high-rated SPCs cheaper. I might go ahead and try and complete uh, R9 Ronaldo's SPC this week now that these are out, I guess is the best way to say it. Um, second one now. Go on, let's see some high-rated. Let's see a high-rated player. It's going to be English striker jamie vardy which version of it is it it's the 86 so i'm guessing it's the highest rated version of each card then uh not bad 86 vardy is pretty decent again don't know how much he's worth he's probably worth about 25 30k i'd guess uh roughly in that ballpark um oh maybe he's worth more actually maybe he's worth a lot more maybe he's worth like 50 i would have guessed he dropped heavily in the in the time that they've come out so it's what half past so it's about 50k that's not too bad actually probably made profit on that one pack and the rest probably not so not too shabby to be fair let's go and open up mine now okay we have 10 packs now to open up for myself we have two 81 pluses and the rest are 84 pluses so this should be quite exciting actually um i'll be surprised if we get a walkout in one of the 81 pluses i will be very surprised uh but 83s would be nice it's gonna be french it's gonna be center back it's gonna be the op is that the op 81 rated you know it's decent for linking but apart from that we don't really care too much but like i said like like informs are becoming very cheap so the high rated icon spcs will become pretty cheap now um we actually have a walkout in the second untradable one let's go go on be something decent something good for spcs at least it's gonna be mexican striker hernandez 84 i think 84 rate not bad actually from an untradable one we'll take that that is not too shabby at all um I'll, I'll happily take that in the club thank you very much yeah now all of these now are tradable so if it's a duplicate it doesn't matter they're all tradable we've got eight tradable ones here let's have a look what we can get i really hope we can get something decent here i really do 
Um, hopefully we can get like a high rate, like like an 88 plus will be fantastic, I think. Um, it's going to be Dutch centre-back Van Dijk. Oh, 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 oh. it's blind. It's not even Delict. Does Delict even have an inform? I don't even think Delict has an inform. I mean, he might. Delict. Does Delict have an inform? Oh, he has an 86 inform. That's so annoying. Oh, I thought he was Delict. I didn't even think about Daily Blind. I mean, 84 rated. We'll store it in the club for now. I really thought that was going to be Van Dijk for a second. I, I, my heart started jumping a bit there when I thought it was going to be Van Dijk. But let's see what this one's going to be now. We want some of the big nations here, EA. Come on. It's going to be French. Goalkeeper. Boutel? I think. Yeah. 86 Boutel. Uh, 86 is a decent, you know. 86 is a, not bad at all. Like I said, like, value of Icon SPCs are going to drop heavily. So having these cards in the club are going to be nice. Like, now is the time if you guys have got a lot of coins like me. Just to start doing, like, SPCs and picking up plays and stuff like that. Because it's the fun time of FIFA. It's July, you know. Let's just have some fun. Let's just have some fun, really. Um, let's see what we can get in this one. Anything decent going to come out of this pack? It's going to be Spanish. Left back, Jordi Alba. Hey, that's high rated. What rating? 89. Not bad at all. Take that, EA. Let's go. 89 rated Jordi Alba. That is fantastic. That is a really, really good one to get. How much does he sell for? Wow. He's actually quite a lot of coins as well. He's like, what, like over 100,000 coins? That is pretty decent, to be fair. We'll take that. We'll happily store that in the club. We've got five packs left. Let's have a look. Let's have a look if we can get anything. That's the best we've had so far. Let's see if we can get anything better than that. Will we get anything better? That's the question. It's going to be German. It's going to be striker Werner. No, it's going to be... Um, I don't even remember this guy's name. Tred, tre, Terode. Okay. No one cares about Terode. Not not great at all, sadly. Uh, we'll store it, though. We'll store it in the club and we'll move on. We've got, what, four left now? I don't think we'll, we'll pack anything better than Jordi Alba. That is pretty decent. I, like I said, like I don't know exactly his price. I could check on Footbin, actually. Um, let me have a look at Jordi Alba's price whilst this pack opens, actually. It's going to be Colombian. Cam. James. Oh! 90. Go on. 91! Oh, my word! Yo, we've had some insane looks so far. So, we've had 89 Jordi Alba, who's about 110,000 coins. Why is James Rodriguez's price right now? That was updated, like, what? Like, nine minutes ago? So, 130k 50 minutes ago is updated. So, we'll have to check and see. Because it goes 139, 140, 155, and then 184. So it might be more, it might be less. Let's have a quick look. So it's about 100, probably about 100,000 coins, I guess. Yeah, probably around 100k. That is still sick. 91 rated. That is fantastic. Let's go. Come on. That's a huge pull. That is insane. I was not expecting a high rated card like that. We've got three more left. I don't know if we'll top that, to be honest. We might, but I don't think we will. Uh, I, I really don't think we will, but we'll see. I think if we top that, it's going to be a really huge card. It's going to be Serbian left back Kolarov. That is good as well. Kolarov's decent because he's high rated and there's not a whole lot of left backs that get good links. So to have an informed left back like that, I think Kolarov actually holds quite a high price regardless. Um, for an 85 inform. Yeah, he always holds around 30 to 40,000 coins. So that is pretty decent. Like I said, left backs hardest, in my, in my opinion, position to link. So that is actually decent. That is, that is not bad at all. Um, we've, got, we've got two more left. Let's see if we can get anything good. Let's see if we can top a 90 on rate James Rodriguez. That is a question. Like I said, if we do, it's going to be a huge, like, really expensive card, if you ask me. I don't know who this is. Um, Howardess, 84 rated. Yeah, that's pretty, that's pretty bad. That's not good at all. Uh, like I said, if we, if we got anything higher than 91, I think we're talking, like, the top tier items at this stage so it's like they're gonna be really expensive cards um so we'll take we'll take like i said like anyone that's like a hundred thousand coins that's really high rated is perfect um so we'll see what we can get in the rest of these or the last one should i say what we're we gonna get in this one it's gonna be german again striker again Werner. no it's gonna be cruz i think is that cruz yeah e4 cruz not an amazing way to end that off but i think we've done pretty decently there to be fair um don't think we've done too badly at all if i look at the club now in terms of just opening 10 to get two cards over like 80 odd rated, like, that's not 80 odd, uh, 89 rated cards. Like, that's pretty decent. By the way, I voted Paulson. Don't regret it. This guy is six foot four with 85 jumping, 86 aggression. This guy will never lose a header. Literally never. Just vote this card if you want to win headers. Um, so we've got 91 Hammers, which is sick. We've got 89 Jordi Alba, 86, 85, 84, 84, 84, 84. Not bad, to be fair. I am happy with the turnaround that we've got from that. And like I said, like we can go and complete, like, for example, um, if we look at like the high rated icon SPCs, 
The ones that I would love to complete at the minute, probably, like, or, or start completing. Pele would be pretty decent to try and complete. Uh, R9, of course, would be amazing to complete. Um, Cruyff, I don't know where Cruyff is, but I'd love to complete Cruyff. Yeah, Cruyff here, I'd love to complete this card as well, because he just looks incredible. Um, is there any other decent ones I'd like to complete? Uh, Maldini wouldn't be too bad, I guess. I do already have some really sick center backs, though. Um, aside from that, like... That's pretty much all the ones I'd want to complete, to be honest. Like, the rest of these, I've already completed, like, most of the really sick ones anyway. Um, so, realistically, now, it's, like, just getting, like, the end game ones. So, now, with R9, I need one, two squads with icons and, and an icon. So, I need three icons. Um, and then, team of the week players. I actually could probably get a good dent of this done. Like, I could probably get this done, to be honest. I reckon I could get this done probably, probably tonight if I tried to. Um, it's not too difficult at all um, in terms of like I've got some informs now for example uh, this this team here this team especially within with the informs I got there that'll help like these two here I'll just use how like an 86 in here and then I just use Jordi Alba for this one and then I'd be able to get a good dent with a few in, uh, untradables I've got so not too bad uh, thank you for watching the video if you guys have enjoyed leave a like down below subscribe to the channel if you guys are new around here thank you for watching and I'll see you later